The man in the middle of the Cambridge Analytica scandal, Christopher Wiley, has agreed to cooperate with investigations into accusations made in a Netflix documentary titled The Great Hack. The documentary refers to Percy Villafana and the Do So campaign in 2010 by the People's Partnership and reported attempts by Cambridge Analytica to influence voters along racial lines. At a media conference today, Attorney General Faris al Rawi said the government has taken steps to bring those culpable to justice. Ian Wayson has more. The Netflix documentary brought to light damning accusations regarding data mining and other offenses allegedly perpetrated by the previous administration. Attorney General Faris al Rawi said the government will take action. In discharge of my obligations, I'm required to call for international cooperation now to bring home this evidence. He itemized what offenses were taken note of. The reference to ethnicity, to data aggregation, to data mining, to Christopher Wiley's testimony that in Trinidad and Tobago there was interception of communication which was unlawful in internet hacking and in micro-targeting. The Attorney General said statements made in the documentary described Trinidad and Tobago negatively. And Wiley said Mr. Wiley has agreed to come to Trinidad and Tobago to give his testimony. He will be given protection. He expressly stated that he was fearful for his life. He expressly stated that he was deeply concerned that if he attended in Trinidad and Tobago on this issue, that he could very well be the subject of violence, if not worse. The documentary also suggested that when it comes to voting, Afro-Trinidadians don't listen to their parents, whereas Indo-Trinidadians do. Ian Wayson, TTT News.